Welcome back everybody. Today I'm here in Limsa and I was looking at the mentor program. It appears I'm only 300 gatherer collectibles away from becoming a mentor. Sounds easy enough. I just need to figure out a way to justify making this a video. There's got to be some way to make this educational towards gill farming or a how-to video. <gasps> I just had an apostrophe. I think you mean an epiphany. Lightning came down and struck my brain. What if I disguise this video as a way to farm white and purple gathering skips to help either get my 590 gear or use it to make Gil buying Earthbreak either sense? Then I have an excuse to get the mentor icon and make it look like a Gil farming video. I like it. I like it. I like it. So the first farm I wanted to show you is for rarefied Davnerian Perella leaves. Found in Davnerian, just north of the Elephant Beast tribe, these can be turned in for white scripts and are optimal because they are always up. You don't need to wait for a certain in-game time for it to spawn. My goal is to get as many collectibles per node while still being able to turn in for scripts. So I will cast Scrutiny and Collector's Focus, then click Brazen Woodsman, hoping the collectability reaches 400. If not, I will click Brazen Woodsman again by itself. Once I'm over 400, I will collect as many as I can per node. Rinse and repeat. I'm also drinking high cordials like their candy to max my GP uptime. Unfortunately, I'm still wearing my level 80, I level 500 white script gear. So my goal is to start upgrading to the 590 purple script gear once I unlocked all the gathering master books with white scripts. Once my bags are full, I head to Razahan and turn in my collectibles. Unfortunately, I'm only getting three white scripts per turn in at quality 400. I could have taken my time and brought back higher quality, but I have a title to complete. Plus, if you need white scripts, I would just do ocean fishing. I would get roughly 500 scripts every two hours without min-maxing the exertions. I've now finished buying all the master books for fishing and botany. I haven't even unlocked mining yet, so I'm not going to buy those at this time. So now I'll be switching over to focus on purple scripts. But first, a new mount dropped on the mug store that I just had to get. It's a crescent moon with a lopperet. I'm sorry, it looks like a giant banana with a tissue. In fact, all three components of the mount look like a mine in the gutter innuendo for something else. Uh, yeah, not gonna go there. Then my fellow MC member posted this gif. And now all I want is a Big Mac. Anyways, back to the farm. We're in Elpis farming rarefied ironwood logs. I'm using the same strat as before and just getting over 400 in order to get my title. But if you're farming scripts, then take the time and attempt for 1000. With my current gear, I only have an 84% success rate. So unfortunately, I'm missing quite a bit. Though with a bit of termination, I completed the achievement. Yay. I now head back to Razahan to turn in my collectibles. I'm slowly on my way to upgrading my gear. I'm planning to only get the purple gear because Don Trail will be out soon. Hopefully it's announced this weekend at PAX East. Oh, fingers crossed. Come on, please. So I don't want to invest in the best gear for such a short amount of time, especially since I'm still trying to max out my gear before Don Trail arrives. I head back to Limsa and over to the Drowning Winch. I talk to the Smith. I accept all the stipulations of becoming a mentor. Yeah, 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 whatever I need to say. <clears throat> and I get my new icon. Woot! Now, I'm immediately gifted with all the knowledge to answer everyone's crafting and gathering questions. Wait, nothing happened. I just received a note saying, just use TeamCraft to figure out your rotations. Oh well, at least I got a cool icon. I hope you enjoyed this fun little video. Consider subscribing for more videos like this in the future. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye.